I be hot all night with the street lights. I get no days off on vacations. You inside, tell me what it be like. The fake love never did change me. I be hot all night with the street lights. I get no days off on vacations. You inside, tell me what it be like. The fake love never did change me. All these people falling off like they dominoes, chilling at the formal in designer clothes. I be politics. What is up, everyone? It's your boy Mike. And it's your boy Darius. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna ultrasound some snakes. We're gonna show you guys our technique. We're gonna check on some follicle sizes, see if we got any growth. And we're gonna just have a good time doing it, educate you guys a little bit, and let's get into it. Let's go. The snake we're gonna ultrasound, guys, is our mystic potion female named Blade. We've been pairing her up with our clown male. They've only locked up one time, so we're gonna check on the follicles, see if they've grown any in the last month. Hopefully they have, that'll be a good sign. I'll definitely pair these guys back up if that's the case. We're going to check it out. I believe last month she was around like 25 millimeters, 20, yeah. 25 millimeters. So, right so we're going to see if maybe they spiked up to 30 or at least grew a little bit. It's been about a month. So AJ, come a little bit closer to us. We're going to get some gel on the wand of the ultrasound machine. And we're going to ultrasound the snake. So let's do it. Fingers crossed, you guys. Come Fingers on, you crossed. guys. So I'm just going to unfold her a little bit. Yeah. And... Uh, Darius, can you just hit the freeze button for me yes, on the sir. ultrasound? Let the game begin. Now let's see if we can find a follicle here. Oh, it's a rip. So when you're ultrasounding, guys, you kind of want to go lateral to the spine. There's a follicle right there. Freeze that. Nice, and we already got a read in there. So you kind of want to go lateral to the spine like that. Now, I would recommend getting a linear probe. This is the rounded probe, unfortunately. I should have done more research when buying my ultrasound machine. But basically, you want to go linear to the spine, and you kind of want to just move up and down the snake. And uh, usually around the midsection right here, you can kind of find the gallbladder. I've been practicing with the ultrasound machine, so I kind of have a good idea where the follicles are sitting already. So that's why I went right to this spot. But once you find the gallbladder of the snake, you can kind of move laterally along the spine, see if you see the follicles, and they're gonna look like little little tiny circles like this. So that's basically the technique. All right, EJ, why don't you get a look at the ultrasound machine. Darry, show them what's going on right here. Look at that. Got some big, nice 28 millimeter follicles right there. She's still building. You know, we're still in the process. She's definitely gonna get paired to King tonight. For sure, man. She definitely grew a little bit, man. So I think another lock will definitely do her good. We're going to throw that male in there. We're going to wipe the ultrasound gel off. And then let's ultrasound the next snake. All right, everyone. So since her follicles grew in size, we're going to pair her up with our boy, King. He is a visual clown male. He's going to the Mystic Potion. And like I said, they've already locked up once. So Darius, do the honors. I want you to pick him up and, and pair him up with our girl, Alayid. Wade's on the run right now. Come here. Come we on, got baby. your boyfriend. We got him. Yes, yes, he said, sir. look at him. Come here, girl. And King has also been breeding to our albino leopard het clown female. She's already ovulated. We're waiting on a clutch from her. So he's soon to be a dad. Hopefully he'll father this clutch too if this girl keeps on growing. But look at the beautiful couple right there, you guys. Let's pray for a lock. Comment. Do you think they're going to lock up tonight? Comment. Come on, let us know. I want to see a lot of yeses in the comments. Fingers crossed, man. Drop the lock emoji. Do whatever you got to do. Say a prayer for us, and we're going to do it. All right, you guys. So we got snake number two. This is our Orange Dream Enchi Hypo Ball Python named Magic. We've been pairing her up with a Leopard Yellow Belly Double Head Pied Hypo. They haven't locked up yet. I believe last time we ultrasounded this girl, she was around 16 millimeters. So we're going to see if she grew a little bit. She is a little bit on the smaller side and is a little bit younger than the last snake you guys saw, but let's see if those follicles grew at all. And again, you guys, I'm just going lateral to the spine. Go ahead and freeze that right there. So we got the follicle right there. Yeah. Cool. Let's see about right there. 
yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah that's good right so unfortunately when we ultrasounded this girl her follicle size actually went down in size she was at about 16 millimeters now it's reading between about 14 to 13 millimeters so i think we're going to shelf this girl for the year we've been pairing her up since october no visual locks with the males and not really much follicle growth within that time frame so i don't feel like it's necessary or worth it to actually continue to pair this animal we're just going to keep feeding her getting her a little bit larger and hopefully next year she'll be ready to go and produce some eggs yeah no bueno next up to ultrasound is our beautiful hypo ghi spider female now she hasn't really been locking up with the male that we've been pairing her with so hopefully those follicles may have grown if not i think we're going to shelf her for the season as you can see we got the shed skin in here still and this is like a little trick for you guys if you're having trouble getting your snakes to lock up leave the female shed in there sometimes the smell of it and the scent of it can actually spur on some breeding from your male so a little tip for you guys i've seen it work before tried it with this girl but it ain't really working so let's do some ultrasound and see what we got going on get some gel right on the wand darius you can hit the button for me yeah, and let's see what's up so we're going lateral to the spine guys find that gallbladder and that's a follicle right there I'm, I'm trying to tell y'all, I've been seeing bigger. this. They definitely got bigger. So last time she was around like 16 millimeters. Let's measure that thing. So next up, we got our pastel, yellow belly, orange dream girl. She's been pairing up with our highway male. They haven't had any locks yet. We're gonna check them out. I started pairing these guys a little bit later in the season because this girl was off of food. But as soon as I put the male back in there, she went right back onto food. So we're gonna check things out, see if her follicles grew a little bit. And last time we ultrasounded her, she was at around 15 millimeters. So hopefully they grew to maybe 20. We'll see. And then if they did, we'll put the male back in. Right, let's do it, you guys. Darius, want to hit the button for me? Yes, sir. AJ, come on in here. And we'll get a little reading on this girl. There you go. I'm ready. Right there. Come on, that one. Yeah, this one right here. All right, you guys, wish me luck. All righty, you guys. So basically what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna measure it from side to side. So basically, that looks good, good right there, right? Yeah, that's good right about there. Boom, and then we're gonna go to the other side, left to right, okay? That look good right there, right? Yeah, that's perfect. Boom. So now we're gonna go up. Be careful when using this thing, it's very sensitive. And I need to clip my nails. <laughs> Don't tell my mom. <laughs> we go up a little bit higher. And then to the left like that. Yeah, always good right there. And then we get that, that reading from top to bottom, guys. Oh, it didn't, didn't register. Go back up a little bit. This is Darius's first time using the ultrasound machine, guys. Yeah, so he's bear learning. With me. He's bear. getting ready, preparing for himself when he does it this year. So this is a good experience for him. Perfect, bro. Right there. Yeah, right about there. So we got a reading of about eighteen point four across and twelve point zero to, from top to bottom. So definitely grew a little bit wider. So I think it's worth at least pairing this girl up one more time and then maybe checking next month. If there isn't any growth, then we'll shelf them, wait till next year, and uh, we'll continue to grow her up and go from there. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I hope you enjoyed seeing some of our snakes getting ultrasounded, checking on the follicle sizes. We had a little bit of growth, so not all hope is lost. We still got a chance with one of those girls. Hopefully this girl will keep growing too. Keep pairing them snakes up, guys. If you're breeding, keep pairing your snakes going to happen eventually you just got to keep at it don't give up i hope you guys have a great night please drop a comment please drop a like please smash the subscribe button and we'll talk to you guys soon peace peace